Now, I don't care how cool the, that uh, Can-Am Spider looks with the two wheels on the front, but those are for people that are scared to lean. You know, I saw a YouTube video yesterday where this guy did top 10 trikes and three-wheel motorcycles. And I, I looked at the comment section, and there was a lot of people on there that was like, dude, you know, I'd get into motorcycling if they had more cool trikes like that, man. Um, it, three wheels are more are safer, dude. You know, and they look cool. You can have a lot of fun on them, man. Dude, they need to come out with more trikes. You know what, guys? In the motorcycle community, real motorcycle riders that have been riding for many years, honestly, trikes do not really get any respect. They are the Rodney Dangerfield of motorcycles out here. <laughs> But I'm going to talk about trikes in this video and tell you my thoughts on them and what they really are for. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. I tell you, some of you guys don't respect the Supermoto, man. Which I don't know why. This is the most fun type of motorcycle you can have out here on the streets, baby. And I did a full build series on my 2019 YZ450 FX custom supermoto I made street legal. I have the build series link in the description and comment section of this video. Now this is some proper fun, baby. Yeah. But you guys talking about a uh, trike. <laughs> that brap brap brap, baby. You like that brap brap brap? Yeah. Now, like this bike, you can go anywhere, go ride over anything, man. Yeah, go ride over anything. Curbs, anything, baby. Make sure you're wearing that gear. Uh, I like this ultra lightweight carbon fiber helmet with auto tent shield, my motor vlog camera, airbag vest to help keep you safe. I have links to all of my gear in the description and comment section of this video. Now, I'll tell you what, when it comes to trikes, man, I'll tell you, when I grew up, guys, I grew up where actually my dad was building a trike before he died. He had, he had the frame completed. And so back then, everybody had custom trikes, man. They're really extremely popular back then. And uh, But these days, very rarely do you see trikes out here. Honestly, really trikes are only pretty much for people that are handicapped, man. People that uh, they have a problem with balance issues or they or whatever, you know, they can't hold a bike up for whatever reason. But even then, I've seen riders out here, guys, that are crippled, that are par There's a guy named Darius Glover that is the coolest. This dude got paralyzed riding his dirt bike. He not only gave did not give up riding a dirt bike he's paralyzed i think from the legs down he not only did not give up riding a motorcycle but this dude had a custom dirt bike built dude rides like a beast on that dirt bike old darius glover does it all without the use of his legs i didn't think that i'll be able to ride he's paralyzed from the waist down what does it do for you makes my heart happy <laughs> love riding dirt bikes what is he? I don't know if he's still doing it now, but he was, man. That is a boss right there, guys. Darius Glover, you are a boss. That's what I'm talking about, guys. He did not give in to the fear and give up his love and passion for dirt bike riding. That is a boss, man. Most people would have gave up riding a dirt bike a long time ago, man. But he never gave it up. And there's another guy that got crippled, got hit on his bike or something and he ended up putting like two little poles on each side with some little wheels on there that kind of helps keep him up but he can still enjoy riding in the twisties um, which I thought that was kind of cool he never gave up man and I think that's cool you know for people or people that don't have legs or just straight up handicapped there's nothing wrong with a trike I think that's amazing to see riders out here riding it, that continues to ride and a trike is excellent for that so they do get some respect in that regard but for a regular healthy rider it, you get no respect riding a trike 
I don't care, man. Now, I don't care how cool the, that uh, Can-Am Spider looks with the two wheels on the front. I see a lot of some of you guys out here riding those. Those are kind of the, the popular trikes right now. But those are for people that are scared to lean. They're scared. And that's the most fun part, one of the most fun parts of the motorcycle is being able to throw that bike around, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, baby. Woo! <laughs> so you lose freedom when you when you it's like a motorcycle with training wheels. Uh, that's what a three-wheel motorcycle is. <laughs> you can do wheelies, by the way, on some of the trikes, man, because my, my friend, his dad built custom trikes out of uh, like Volkswagens and Man, he put powerful engines on there and he would he put wheelie bars on them and you could actually wheelie on those bikes. Yeah, baby. Yeah, good old times out here on the streets. You know, if you're just riding in a straight line like I'm doing right now, of course, uh, you'd probably be just fine on a trike, man. But even then, you know, it's cool being go around that corner. Look at that. Just, you look, you just like going around slowly around a little corner. It's just fun being in having freedom on two wheels. But three wheels, it takes away that freedom, man. It takes away the freedom. What do you guys think? How do you guys feel about trikes? Because I've heard, you know, some of you guys are like cycle cruiser, dude. You got to try a spider. Don't knock it until you try it, dude. I know a lot of you guys, some of you guys have recommended that I get a uh, spider can am spider which i think they're grossly overpriced like the yamaha niken uh i don't know what that sucker is it's got two wheels on the front you can enjoy twisties on that trike but i never saw the point in that it just adds a bunch of weight and price it's got the the mt09 engine on there 115 horsepower 847 cc triple cylinder engine same as the mt09 engine Uh, but it's got the two extra stupid wheel on the front <laughs> I mean seriously guys what do you need the extra wheel for I never understood that tell me why do you need that extra wheel on the Nike is that gonna make your riding experience any more fun uh, I don't know also you know one thing one trike that I think is cool though is the that Russian three by three? That thing looks sick. It's like an amphibious motorcycle. You can actually go ride that in the lake, and it pretty much rides over anything. I think that is absolutely awesome. I could definitely see myself having one of those. That's amazing, man. That's probably the only track I think is really cool, though. Uh, some of you guys like I've seen on a tri glide. <laughs> the tri glide Harley Davis. You know, I know there's other trikes out there. There's a V8M that's actually four wheels. They kind of have two smaller wheels together in the back, two big wheels in the front, and it's got a V8 engine, 4.6 liter V8 engine, freaking 400 and something horsepower. <laughs> that thing is a beast, man. But I don't understand the fun in that really though. You know what I'm saying? You might as well be in a convertible car or something. If you're going to be on four wheels, I, I don't see the point and the fun in it. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Woo! Rip on that back boy! <laughs> some ripper ripping it up yeah yeah but anyways guys don't forget to subscribe to my all of a motorcycle channel make sure to check out my other channel bug out moto deuces thumbs up check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel bug out moto where i customize a van for my motorcycle so i can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere 
subscribe to my YouTube channel, Bugout Moto.